this week's episode of Smosh Pit Weekly. My name is Mari and I'll be wrapping up some of the best articles seen on the Smosh Pit this week. Make sure you check out the links down below to see the full articles on SmoshPit.com. Ah, oh, viral videos. The phenomenon that can take an unknown person and make her into a superstar overnight. All it takes is a couple million people around the world to see you win or fail, be adorable, or flash your private parts. So how do we make a viral video? If you take babies and mix in hot girls and sprinkle in some kittens and boil it all down in a giant witch's cauldron, would that be the right recipe for a viral hit? Actually, if you took babies, hot girls, and kitties and boiled them in a pot, that would be murder, so don't do that. Tabuskis seems to understand the inner workings of going viral, and he explains it all in his video conveniently titled Viral Song. Why are we talking about cashews? Damn you, Toby, your ADHD is infectious. I didn't ask you for shh. You don't have to thank me, Tim Tim. Season two of Oishi High School Battle premiered this week on Shut Up Cartoons. It is my personal favorite cartoon on the channel, minus Smosh yeah! Babies, of course, because I'm vain and I love seeing myself as a cartoon baby. But nonetheless, it is a kick-ass show about a pink-haired demon hunter from space. Plus, she's super kawaii. Hello, students. of Kawaii, the Oishi High School Battle Kawaii Collection is now available online. It's basically a mini movie that includes all of the first season's episodes, plus new content, as well as a fully animated origin series so you can find out what the f Oishi is really about. And who the f noodles? Is it a cat? Is it edible? I don't even know. I just want one. Make sure to catch the new series on Shut Up Cartoons on Fridays and check out the Kawaii Collection on iTunes by finding the link down below. Since last week's episode was a Thanksgiving Day episode, I didn't get a chance to show you guys this next video. It is most excellent. Bam. Uh-huh, honey. What you doing in the club on a Thursday? She said she only here for a girl birthday. So Kanye West released his newest music video, Bound 2, a couple of weeks back. It features a topless Kim Kardashian, Kanye on a bike, Kanye wearing plaid, horses, about a thousand jump cuts to sexy, seductive kissy faces, and the worst green screen ever. It's like they made this video at one of those music video booths at the local carnival. Now, if Bound 2 wasn't already entertaining enough, James Franco and Seth Rogen went ahead and remade the video frame by frame. Turn the plane around, your ass keep complaining. How you gonna be mad on vacation? Ducking one around all these Jamaicans. If Seth Rogen playing Kim Kardashian isn't the sexiest thing ever, then slap me with a badger and call me Nelly. What? Enjoy. And the Oscar goes to James Franco for perfectly reenacting Kanye's arm flapping. I mean, interpretive dancing. Uh, I mean, uh, rapping hand gestures. Check out the full video by finding the link in the description box below. Bam. Well, that's it for this week, you guys. All the links to the full videos and articles are down below. Social networking mumbo jumbo is over here, and other videos from the week are here. Don't forget to answer these questions in your comments below. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next week. Masadaishune! Questions, 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 questions. I don't know if I'd want to be a companion, honestly. I mean, excuse me for the spoilers, but they're left in alternate universes or their memories are totally wiped, left to die in a hotel for the rest of their lives. They kind of get the short end of the stick, if you know what I mean. I just want to be the doctor. I would simply want to be him. God, that would be fantastic. I sadly don't have godparents. Oh, that's so tragic. Does that mean I just get to choose my godparents then? Because if I had a choice, I would want Harrison Ford to be my fairy godmother or father or whatever. And he could come save me from random events like boring cocktail parties and his Millennium Falcon. Happy birthday this week to Iman, Grace, Emily, Alexis, Daniel, Alexander, Zane, Tori, Siska, Lily, and Halleck. Have an awesome one, you guys.